Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the Loftec brand. This is their car vacuum cordless cleaner. It's a handheld portable car vacuum cleaner with high power professional vacuum cleaner for your car. And it's unique because it has wet and dry use. This has amazing suction. It uh, has high power and easy to remove pet hair, snacks, fragments, sand, even coins. It can also remove liquids in your car, uh, which is unique. It's, uh, there are three different types of tools and adapters. We're gonna go over all those that allow you to get into corners and hard to reach places. The company provides a one year warranty and you could register and uh, get an additional six months. The uh, kit comes right in front of you right here. You can see everything it also comes with an instruction manual and it has contact information for Loftec. You can also contact them, Amazon messaging system. Now this has a HEPA filter that is washable. And what's nice is they provide two of them. You can see one right there. There's one inside the unit. We're gonna do a close up of that. And that allows you to clean that and thoroughly dry it and then swap back and forth. So you really have uh, no, no downtime. Now we're gonna do a test on this to see how long it will run. Uh, get an idea of the uh, use time on here. But typically it takes about uh, two to four hours of charging. Now I'm gonna show you how to go about charging the unit. Now it's very simple to charge. The Loftec car vacuum cleaner it comes with an AC adapter. When you first plug it in, you'll see it's green. And on the vacuum cleaner, on the bottom handle portion, there is a plug and you plug it in right there. And then you'll notice that the indicator goes to red. I don't know if the camera's picking that up, but it, it's red. Now when the unit is finished charging after two to three hours, the status indicator will go to solid green, letting you know that it's fully charged. Going over some of the specs of this, as I mentioned, has the HEPA filter, and it, it uh, will draw 120 watts um, at uh, whatever voltage is internally here, but there is lithium ion batteries in there. And uh, that's nice because you don't have to worry about memory and things like that. And it's charges and allows you to use this for a long time in your car. Let's take a look at uh, the attachments here. You have a brush attachment. You have a long flexible tube. We're gonna show you how to connect that up. It has the power adapter as I showed how to charge. And, and it has a very uh, special nozzle which allows you to pick up a lot of dust. Also, you could scoop up milk or water or soda in your car. Now let's, before I go into the attachments, I'm gonna show you how this operates, very simple. There's a power switch right here. Comes on, and you have side vents that blow the air back. And this is a very quiet vacuum cleaner. I have a couple other ones, and this is uh, about 20% more quiet. Now to, to remove this cover, you just push this orange button right there, and then this drops forward. And there is the intake port on there. Let's see if I can get a flashlight here so you can see that. That's the intake port where the motor is. And then we have the actual front of the unit and there's the company name on there. And there's the opening there that fits the attachments. And this HEPA filter, there's two of them. There's a little pull tab right there. It only fits back in there one way. You can't go this way because it won't, won't line up. So it only fits in there one way which is nice so that you don't have an issue with knowing how to put it back in there. Now these vacuum cleaners, um, some of them have flaps on this one on the front and this one does not have any flap and I think they do that so that you could use it for wet and dry and liquid will pool on the bottom of the unit. So let's put this back on right here. You just put it right like that and push that button and it locks back in place. Now we're going to use attachments. If you look at the front nozzle right here, this fits in here just like that. And you could uh, use it 
to scoop up liquid and dirt, just like that. And you can also flip it around and go right on your surface to pick up debris. Now you have this brush attachment and the same thing, you go like that. And then you go and you could use it with the brush attachment to pick up dirt in your car. Now if we take this, there's a uh, an adapter right here that's included and you plug it in to the front and then you have this flexible tube and it goes inside just like that and it forms a nice compression joint on there. Then you have the other side right here and then you could put the included other adapter on there and this is a nice flexible material and that holds it in place just like that and now you could use those same attachments that I showed just like that so that you can have the full flexibility of the vacuum cleaner with these attachments on there and this is nice because that way you can go and you can vacuum out crevices and areas in your car door without having to have the thickness of the vacuum cleaner in place. I'm going to do a test here. I've got it fully charged and I'm going to see how long this thing will run. Okay, so it's been running for 17 minutes and it's still running, but the power has dropped about 15% at this time. So let's turn that off. So it ran about 17 minutes, uh, usable, you can still use it beyond that. The manual says it lasts for 20 minutes, the listing says a half hour. So in reality, you're going to get 17 minutes of use in this and that's not bad that's that's a good average i've tested about five of these and they all run about 15 minutes the rechargeable ones so i'm i'm happy with that so we're going to demonstrate this in my car and see how well it does so here i am in my car and there's crackers and pieces of grass and twigs and things down there and we're going to Give this a try. I'm going to just use the basic brush attachment there. So you can see it did a good job and you can see all the crumbs right inside there. Now if you want you could use this attachment right there. You can see that allows you to essentially scoop up the mess and now we could put the extension on here and then we can go with the brush like that and then we have the extension so now we could do that also
it's also picking up some dog hair and people hair in there, which is nice. Now here I can do these doors using the extension piece on here. If you hear that sound, it actually vacuums up some some change. It allows you to go inside your pockets here. I'm going to pour a little milk right here. Now this should work with any liquid. Just that milk allows us to see a little better. So that worked. Now you want to wipe it of course, but let's take a look. You can see the milk is right right in the bottom right there and we can just pour that out so it does work with collecting liquids well you can see the debris in there and it stays in place and doesn't really go to the front nozzle and very easy to clean just push the orange button right there take the HEPA filter out and I shake it and there's all the crumbs in here and just Put the HEPA filter back in, it only goes in one way, and line the bottom up, push the button, and that's it. Ready, ready for more vacuuming. And after you're done using the unit, you could just take the filter and the inside part, rinse it out, let this dry. Don't use any harsh chemicals on it, just water will work. Then let this dry. And because they have, and because there's two of these, you put the dry one in place and you could go ahead and do more vacuuming. So, what's my overall opinion about the Loftec brand, their car vacuum cleaner, the cordless handheld portable vacuum cleaner with high power? Let's demonstrate this thing works really nicely. It's, it's quieter than other ones, has two HEPA filters has all the attachments you need. You don't have to worry about having a USB port on here because it has its own charger. And the runtime is great, and this worked really well as I demonstrated. So I think you're gonna like this product. I certainly like it. I'm gonna give it a full five-star rating on my channel. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to alert to new video uploads. And if you like this review, please hit the like button. I hope the information I presented helped you with your buying decisions. Thank you for watching.